daughter remembers her mother gone too soon after a drunk driver caused a wreck that took her mother's life. It was 10 years ago, a loving mother of four was on her way to pick up her child from the airport, but she never made it. Now her family shares the damage drinking and driving can cause. 25 News reporter Aaron Heft has the story. Remembered as joyful and loving, Cheryl Guberman hugged one of her girls goodnight and drove off towards the airport. I think when you say she was the best mom of ever, I think everyone says that about their mom, but I really feel that um, her whole life was devoted to us. I always kind of describe it as that thing where, you know, your mom hugs you and kisses you and you're like, Ugh, OK, yeah, no problem. Uh, try and push your mom away as a typical 16 year old. Guberman was headed to pick up her son returning from college, but he noticed his mom's arrival time had come and gone and she was nowhere to be found. He was kind of waiting for a while and he called my dad. So um, my dad drove out to get him and on their way back, um, they ended up kind of seeing what looked like an accident. The mother of four had been rear ended, sending her truck over a freeway overpass. Her husband woke their children and gave them the worst news of their lives. He just said she's not OK. And um, I think I just knew what he meant by that. And it was, yeah, she was hit by someone who was um, twice over the legal limit that night. She's now been gone for 10 years and her daughter Emily is saddened to know. My kids, my husband will never know my mom because of that person's decision that night. Asking people who were deciding whether to get behind the wheel to think twice. But it's hard to have a family member and in an instant have to be grieving um, over someone you've lost um, because of someone else's decision. Aaron Heft, 25 News, Waco. Aaron, thank you. Guberman's daughter, Emily, in 2015, honored her late mother by running a thousand miles from Waco to Chicago for the Mothers Against Drunk Driving organization.